when my son was born, he was premature. Uh, so he had to stay in the hospital for a few weeks before we could take him home. And I remember looking at him in the, through the glass of the incubator and the incubator looks so big, you know, he's in there, small little skinny fella, um, less than five pounds of weight, hardly any hair in his head and he just looked so helpless, but he was the best thing that ever happened to me. And my life had changed and I knew my life had changed, that I'd become a different person overnight as soon as I'd held him in my arms for the first time. And I just wanted to be the best possible dad that I could be to him and to, to help him to lead the best life that I could lead. Now, forward uh, 23 years and life has happened for me, career has happened. I'm living in Spain for a year um, and my son is still back in Galway in Ireland and he came over to visit us for a week. And I remember sat just after Christmas on my balcony looking over the, the, the beach and I've got a blanket wrapped around me, it's cold, and I can see him pacing backwards and forwards in front of me um, with his head down in the sand looking for this iPod that he'd lost the night before when we were out getting drunk. And I just thought back to that, to that moment when he was born, when I saw him in the, the incubator, and how much I'd promised, you know, to, to help him to live that best possible life that he could live. And there I was teaching him and showing him how to have fun with alcohol. Um, I stopped drinking four, four days later and I never looked back. It was the best decision that I've ever made in my life. It made me rethink so many different things about myself and who I was, uh, my values, um, where I, how I got to where I was in my life. But it had changed in an instant and he was the, the catalyst for both of those changes. Now, I believe that you don't have to wait for something great to happen in your life before you can change it. It doesn't have to be um, a huge occurrence. Change can happen in a moment. And um, once you make that decision, it can be tough to, to make the changes stick, but uh, you can do it and you can make these things happen. Um, I'm Kevin O'Hara for Habits Unplugged. We help people to stop drinking alcohol and to live the best possible versions of themselves.